What's up traders? Uh, just one trade today and it was not a very big one and uh, we'll jump right into it. But before I do, um, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, I'm not going to be here tomorrow or Monday. I'm leaving tomorrow morning very early to go to my friend's bachelor party down in Mexico, Puerto Vallarta. And uh, so I won't be here. I'm leaving, like I said, tomorrow morning and then I won't be back until Monday night. Uh, so hopefully um, I'll be good to go Tuesday morning, but I am getting home kind of late. So um, we'll see. I'm pretty sure I I don't I haven't talked to the wife if I actually am waking up with the kids or if she's staying home that day. I honestly don't know. So I have to actually talk to her about that. But um, yeah, uh, on to the trade here on F-Cell. Nothing too crazy. Uh, as you can see, it was a move uh, at the bell. Went up through the half dollar, made a decent little move. Uh, got short, um, went smaller size because I didn't really like the move. It wasn't really that extended. was really hoping it would go up through seven. I actually had an order for twice the amount of shares uh, in the mid 690s, um, but it just didn't want to get there. So I decided to take half the shares. And um, I also believe I when I tried to get in, I ended up getting in five cents under where I decided to do that. Uh, because it started to drop. So I kind of chased it down uh, five cents higher or lower than I would have liked. And yeah, that ended up being the trade on F cell. It worked out right away and took it off. So a little frustrating. Um, I, there was a lot of trades today where I put orders out. There was one that I missed by a penny. Uh, it was GBR. Literally missed me by a penny. Had it at four. I was it. The, I think it was the first move. I don't even remember if this was the ticker, to be honest. Maybe it was, I don't know, maybe it was Kala. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, it was Kala because I had it at 154. I thought it was 155. I don't remember what ticker it was. Maybe it was RKDA. There was a lot. I mean, it had, there was a lot where I had orders. It was this one. It was RKDA because this was 154, right? Yeah, I had the order here at 155 and we didn't get filled. And um, it really ticked me off. But there, I think GBR. Missed me by like three cents on this one. I think I was at 461 or something like that. So maybe it was five cents, six cents, whatever. There was a lot that we would just, we weren't getting that extra push. And it was just very frustrating. It was like, it was extending. And then you're waiting for that like blow off candle. And we just weren't, we weren't getting it. And I kept putting my orders to where it would be if it happened. And we just, it just wasn't happening. Um, I do remember that that RKDA trade, I had a decent amount of shares. It was, 400. Yeah, I had 400 out here and it immediately dumped uh, 15 cents. So that would have been a really good trade. It would have been $40, $50 trade. Just didn't happen. And uh, that's kind of what's been happening all day. Uh, the one I just had up, uh, what, what were we just watching? It was RKDA. I just had it up again. Um, I had an order up here uh, through two. It was at two, 207. And we got the 198. So again, it was extending, extending, and we're looking for that pop through a key area. And not getting it. So just going to end it here. Uh, small day. It's green. So I hate sometimes that I sound this way. Like I sound so upset, but yet we're green. I remember again, you know, not even a year ago that I was just hoping to be green uh, on a daily basis. So the fact that I am and I'm getting upset about it, it, you know, I, I feel like I'm not humble about it because um, I should be. Right. I should be thankful that I found a profitable strategy. I just get a little frustrated sometimes because I'm ready to move forward and the market sometimes just isn't giving us the opportunities that we'd like. And um, I just want those opportunities so that we can uh, scale and actually start making a big deal out of this. So, again, uh, if in the future, maybe a year from now, we're 10x the size that we are now, you know, that one small trade's 150 bucks. It's not such a bad day. Right. Uh, but unfortunately at this, at this size, you know, it's only $15 and it's, it, it can get frustrating. Um, like yesterday, uh, yesterday I felt was a, a slow day. We made $54, but if that's $540, it's, it's a whole different story, right? So process, process over profits. I have to keep reminding myself that. And, uh, yeah, that's all I got. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Again, I won't be here Friday or Monday. So have a good Friday and Monday as well as a good weekend. And I will see you guys back here on Tuesday. Peace.